welcome. We are us, and this, this is not Tomb of the Guardian. This is Metamorphos. It is a free game on Steam that is about as close to a Souls-like as you can get, I could say. Now, personally, this is my second time seeing the game. And for those of you who will find themselves mildly interested at the prospect of a Souls-like, be aware that this is... Where was I going with this? Oh, this is my second time <clears throat> recording this game. I mean, you could say it's the second time I recorded the game, but that's not really true. The first time I didn't even click the record button, so I was just speaking into a mic that wasn't actually doing anything for me. Long ago, a great evil descended on our temple, corrupting our oasis and our people. Amathani sent our guardian to seal a great evil corrupting the temple. With the evil seal, the water began to flow again, bringing life and prosperity. <clears throat> so, keep in mind that my performance here is <clears throat> a result of, I don't know, about 30 to 40 minutes worth of play prior to what you're seeing now. Oh, and another thing to keep in mind if this game interests you, you have to beat it all in a single run because if you stop, if you quit the game, you will be forced to start from where we just did a moment ago. Suck it. Here rests our guardian, blessed by Amathani, who will awaken again when our temple is in danger. You guys know he's not there anymore, right? Like, looks like he left a while ago. It's weird, but I mean... I mean, I get it. This place sucks. I wouldn't stay here either. I only just recently discovered you can actually destroy these things. I sure hope this game plays nicely with OBS, now that it's recording. You will find yourself quickly hating the guys that shoot fire, like, ooh. 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 So much. And these things, because their hitboxes are wonky. Oh, and they have s extreme tracking, even through your dash. I dashed up a wall. I also just discovered a while back in the recording that never was that it's better to just brute force your way through hits, especially because these guys will stun lock you if they get you in a corner. So if you're going to eat damage at the risk of dying, at least make sure you kill them. And don't get hit by this guy. Just don't. You don't 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 do that. There's nothing you can do to alleviate being on fire.
as I said, it's it's just better to eat the damage and go for the kill. You know, I was going to go and showcase fighting this guy who went through the wall. But the issue is you don't get anything from actually fighting enemies. There's no... As I said in the video that never was, there's no form of character growth or progression in this game outside of the adventure itself. Welcome, travelers. All are welcome to rest and be rejuvenated by Amathani's grace. I cannot fight this thing. I cannot fight the Scorpion King while facing the rest of this area. That's better. Oh good, those will block attacks. <laughs> and they shoot each other. That's a no. I'll admit that there's a large lack of, of, of finesse going on here. But again, trying to play cute in this game. One of these guys. God dang it, the lunge on this kid. of dying or anything. Unless the frame rate tanked, in which case I would have perished. I had to go all the way back and do all of that again. Keep in mind that there are only two attacks, the light attack and the heavy attack. And there's only one form of defense, being your sand dash. This is fine, I mean, for the beginning of a game. But it doesn't really become anything more. That's terribly awkward. Terribly, terribly awkward. Sir, could I could have been to you to not? It's really awkward having you 
rub yourself up against my glass corpse? Because that's what these are. You make these when you die. Depending on how you die. I've only died so many times, frankly. But of the times I've died, I've only actually created one glass copy. Well, this is where we are now. Also bear in mind that you cannot jump. You know, I completely forgot that I could just ignore that guy and run past him. I can't get across that bridge, though. I was going to go that way because I had never gone that way before. Ooh, what's this? Ahead lies the Temple of Cleansing. Enter and become reborn from the blessed waters of life. They lied. Sorry, folks, I'm just not that into you. Dang it. With the frame rate being as wonky as it is in particular areas or when I'm facing in a particular direction, Avoiding these guys, since combat doesn't actually do anything for you, aside from getting you killed, but make you waste potions, I suppose. Avoiding combat is pretty difficult. This is where I left off, well, this is where I ended the video that wasn't meant to be. Ugh, looking back out there just tanks the frame rate again. That is a, ugh, it's, ugh, it's awful seeing that. It had taken me a really long time to get to that particular area. The... The oasis just a moment ago. Oop, I almost died. Right, there's nothing to really explore for. That is a significant chunk of bridge missing. So let's see what you have to offer, sir. I'm Char the Corrupter. Nope, I cannot fight you while looking in that direction. Uh. Oh. 
I couldn't dash for a little bit there. Feeling it now, Mr. Krabs. Uh, let's try and get to this before I die. Huh. That was as much a battle against the terrible optimization. Well, I don't want to call it terrible. That was as much a battle against the terrible. I did it again. That was as much a battle against the bad optimization as it was against the boss. So let's see what this has to say. The scorpions of this land are the, s the scorpions are the sentinels of this land, answering only to the guardian themselves. No longer, it seems. keep wanting to explore only to realize that this isn't that kind of game. Behind these doors is the Shrine of Amanti. Nope, I keep saying it wrong. Or at least I keep seeing it wrong in my head. Behind these doors is the Shrine of Amanti. See? I keep doing it. Behind these doors is the Shrine of Amathani. Only those deemed worthy are allowed entry. Well, I have no other direction to go, so... Hmm. So I guess that's how we'll do it. That was unpleasant. Am I correct in assuming the guy in the far left is the flamethrower? Yes. trying to attack not drink the potion. The potion is on the X button <clears throat> and your light and heavy attacks are on the shoulder and well right shoulder and trigger buttons. So the difference between these guys, not the scorpions, but the flamethrowers and the normal scimitar wielding idiots is much more pronounced in a dark area than it was outside. That's right, walk right into it. The judgment. Come get yours today. Oh, we almost forgot this. 
these aqueducts disperse life unto our lands. We must not let them fall to disrepair so as to keep the source flowing. Meanwhile, in reality, There, there's no stealth, so there's so we might as well just go ahead and do this. Of course not. Who shot me? Somebody shot me with fire. Exactly are we We're down here now. This is less of a problem than one would think. Actual brick. Fine, you can keep that area. Hey, maybe we'll finally get a fair fight. Last time it was two on one. Now we get to face off against Navaset the Defiler. Cool. Oh, great. There we go. Huh. Well, he toasted my oats. true Dark Souls fashion, we don't deal with that. died there. What? I have no idea what hit me that second time. I just took a hit and then died for an extra bit of damage. For free, basically. I love that. Wow! They just gave me the business.
this again. Lightly singed. It went through him. My glorious counterattack only went through him. down and then cooks you. Wonderful. I like being stunlocked. That's perfectly fair. Should have been hit there. Let's just call it what it was. Don't kill me. time and hopefully let's not get gang banged in the corner again this is a Tuesday wow I was going to say this is just a Tuesday after all we can't be doing Friday things on a Tuesday okay come get yours Really? How the frick did that miss? His back step is too powerful. Why the frick do we keep losing our... Well done. is tiresome. You okay? That could have gone poorly. God dang it. Uh, 
This game can be pretty unintuitive sometimes. Why are you like this? Maybe one day he'll actually come attack. But if he walks at me, he gets the axe. We're going to die to this, aren't we? And there's nothing I can do about it. I would really like to avoid getting my titties slapped in this area over here. Because that seems to be a large contributor. <sighs> Look at this come at me bro energy. Huh. Okay. Oh, God. Please never do that again. I'll give you a free hit. See? What the frick? I was out of stamina. fully aware I was playing sloppy there. I know that. One, two, three, four, five dashes is all I get. had enough stamina to get away. in mind that when he does the swing attack where he steps in there are two variations to that attack he can either swing once or he can swing twice usually he only swings the one time and I get the free heavy attack Please stop doing that.
on, you're going to have to heavy attack me before I do anything. I really wish the lock would stop disengaging. Great! My animations are bugged. There we go. Oh, that's even worse. <sighs> Alright, this is going to be the last time. We're coming up on 40 minutes and I didn't want to be playing this anywhere near this long. See what happens here. God. Oh, are you serious? For those of you that are, for whatever reason, interested in this game, keep in mind there, the key to getting the boss to only swing one time for his light attack is to evade just as it's about to hit you, so that apparently it breaks the AI and he figures, eh, I don't need the second hit. Which is weird, because if he did hit you, you'd go with the second hit, right? Right, we know this because we took that second hit because we got the first hit, or hit by the first one, anyway. So keep that in mind, that's for the first part of the boss fight. Just evade the light attack just as it's about to hit you to break the second one, or prevent the second one from being unleashed. That gives you the free heavy, and you're gonna, you know, follow up and continue to dance from there. I think a heavy into a light and then a dash, just, no, that's way too much stamina. Anyway, I'm going to leave it at that because I am tired of being killed for free. Granted, I stopped taking it as, as seriously after the, what, third death and just started to do whatever. Then it started to bug out. Can't have that. And... Once I quit the game, it's going to throw me all the way back to the beginning, and I'm probably never... You're, you guys are probably never going to see this game again. That said, it wasn't bad up until I got killed for free because of... Is it a glitch or a bug? Either way, I won't be, I won't be recording this again, but I hope you guys have enjoyed yourselves up until now, or, you know, the first of the two free kills the boss got. It's not like it was a terrible experience, it was just unpleasant at times. So if you're interested in the game, keep in mind that it is free on Steam and it's it weighs about 2.15 gigs, so if you've got the space for it and the time, why not? Frankly, there's nothing to lose. And so with all that said, we will see you next time.